thought of the day. Me time. That goes for you. Let me tell you something. You guys don't exercise or make time just for yourself. You're going to drive yourself crazy being around people 24-7. Everybody needs a little solitude. Um, just, I'm not talking about all the time, but like, you know, like my wife and I, you know, we have six children between the two of us. Um, three of them are grown, uh, but well, one of them came back to the house. So we have four kids in the house, four kids, um, a dog and six cats, <laughs> all rescues. <laughs> Anyway, <clears throat> um, finding your, your, your space, everybody needs their space and everybody should respect that about each other too. And that's really, um, I noticed throughout the years, it's, it's when you're in a relationship, you know, um, people that are insecure or controlling, you know, want to just consume all of your time. And I get it. It's, you know, when you're in love and stuff like that, but like, you got to find that space. You gotta find your your time to just sit with your own thoughts and, and not be polluted by uh, everybody else's, even though it's great to, you know, obviously have good friends, family, whatever, and uh, bounce some like ideas when you're, you know, brainstorming with other people is great. But at the end of the day, having your own space and your own time for your thoughts is, man, it's so important. I know for me, it's a necessity. When I first met, um, when I first met Jenny, it was one of the first conversations we had. I was like, listen, I was like, no matter what, don't be offended if I'm like, you know, I need like, I need a, a few hours where I just, I gotta be alone in my thoughts. And, and, and literally every day I need some time. Um, everybody's different. Uh, everybody handles things differently, everybody. Uh, so this is, you know, obviously it's not, some people can be around people 24 seven and they're just great with it and they function high function that way. And that's, that's great. But a lot of us out there, a lot of us need some time to ourselves and finding that time sitting in your car. Here I am, nice, quiet, peaceful. Kylie's running around out there. <laughs> now she's with her mom right now. <laughs> right now we're uh, in there. I just figured I'd come out in the car, turn the AC on and, um, See here, I was like, man, thought of the day. Yeah, that's great. You know, like you're just having your your me time, a little just a little space. Go in your car, go, bar, you know, bar the keys if you're young and you need it. You say, hey, mom, can I sit in the car in the driveway and turn the AC on for a minute? I need some space. <laughs> or if you got your own bedroom, you know, whatever. Um, you know, obviously being in uh, in a relationship, we share a room. Um, I'm blessed to have a garage where. Um, you know, all our stuff is out there, but I do have, they all respect me when I go out to the garage, the kids and stuff, they come in and I'm like, they, and they ask and it's like, Hey, can I, can I come in? I'm like, yeah, 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 yeah. But I do have, I have the, uh, that space, you know what I mean? And, uh, if I didn't, I'd be sitting in the car all the time, <laughs> at least an hour a day. It's just so important for me. And I figured, you know, I, I just put it out there and, um, it's nice to hear like, you know, when I when I when I talk about these things like thought of the day or my songs of the day or something like that, it's um, I'm not preaching to anybody. I'm just kind of I think it's always good to hear uh, it spoken. Sometimes things things spoken are, are good. You know, like I said, you know, you have when you have friends, you bounce ideas off each other. Boom. It sparks something um, just like my whole uh, if you all don't know, I'm revved up art on my other page. Um, and uh, that one's, I'm trying to focus, I'm trying to shift focus over here, knowledge is power, just having more of a discussion of like thought of the day, song of the day, stuff like that. And keeping my art page uh, just about art. So <clears throat> kind of making that transition right now. And if you're just uh, linking up with me on this one and you don't know about revved up art, check it out, type in revved up art. Um, I pull right up and uh, I got some cool stuff out there. I do a lot of drawings and everything like that, but. Uh, this page is different. This page is just about 
about knowledge and I love for I love for people to chime in and, and uh, I love the comments I actually posted a song of the day and somebody put um hey check this song out and I did and it was awesome and I loved it so thank you guys for that I forget uh, I forget who it was but I'll uh, I'll do a shout out video man it was really cool but anyway find your peace find your uh, space whatever another place and not uh, y'all are gonna laugh but if you you know, if you're like, yo, I don't even, I don't have a car. I'm surrounded by family 24 seven. Go take a shit. <laughs> Go to the bathroom, lock the door. <laughs> I was making myself saliva here. Seriously. Go in the bathroom. Go take a shower. When you get out of the shower, sit on the toilet, even if you don't have to go. Play on your phone. Find some space just to just to kind of reconnect yourself. You know what I mean? It's always good. Uh, I don't know if you guys practice mudras. These are mudras. It's a connection. It's actually, it's not just spiritual. It's actually scientific. Holding your hands. I know you a lot of, if you've ever seen like um, uh, people of power, you know, they, 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 they hold their hands certain ways. Um, some famous people do it. Uh, Trump does it. A few other people. Anyways, um, look that up. And I'll actually, maybe I'll post something about the mudras. But um, they actually help you connect the, the energy in your in your mind. Um, and it seems to be working. It's, it's, it's very interesting. It's very interesting. So check that out. Um, all right, guys. Just find your space and uh, always follow your heart.